lot of people are taking a good look at the Olds F-85 and the Buick Special these days. Now, that's understandable. Those two cars should get a lot of attention this year. After all, they're both brand new compacts. But, uh-oh, we shouldn't label these two cars compacts. Why not? Because Oldsmobile and Buick are carefully not using that word this year. For instance, Buick prefers phrases like new size sizzler or smaller than big or even bigger than small. And Oldsmobile? They prefer smaller than standard or thrift sized entry in low price field. How come? Here's how come. Both the Buick Special and F-85 are really compact cars in size, appointments, and just about everything else except one thing, price. That's what makes the word compact an unpopular word with Buick and Olds this year. Fact is, the F-85 and Buick Special four-door sedans, they don't offer a two-door model, are priced above the lowest-priced 1961 Ford, Chevrolet, and Plymouth four-doors, and are within $87 of the Mercury Meteor 600, and almost sky-high above the smart new 1961 Comet four-door sedan. Let's just check some typical price examples to see the tremendous price advantage you get with Comet. For instance, in four-door sedans, Comet's suggested retail price is $331 less than either the F-85s or Buick Specials. In four-door station wagons, Comet's suggested retail price is $328 less than that of the F-85 and Buick Special four-door wagons. Your customer can save even more on a comma two-door sedan or two-door station wagon for the simple reason that Olds and Buick don't offer any two-door models in their F-85 and special series. So, your customer can save as much as $386 on the six-passenger comma two-door sedan and up to $371 on the comma two-door station wagon. Yet, the money you save is only part of the story. When it comes to measuring the 1961 Comet against the Buick Special and Olds F-85, there are six other big reasons for picking Comet. Models and choices, functional design, construction and finish, performance, riding comfort, and economy. Take models and choices. We've already seen how the Buick Special and Olds F-85 are available only in four-door models. On the other hand, Comet offers a choice of either a two-door or a four-door in both sedans and station wagons. And of course, the extra safety of a two-door model is something any family with young children usually wants. Another thing, a lot of people want the ultimate in fine car appointments, but at compact car prices. You get that choice with Comet. Comet offers an optional deluxe trim kit for every model. To provide comparably equipped models, however, both Olds and Buick step up to a considerably higher cost deluxe series. How much higher cost? Well, let's compare. This chart lists various deluxe trimmed Comet models beside various special and F-85 deluxe series models. At suggested retail prices, let's see the Comet price advantage in each case. On four-door sedans, $379. On four-door station wagons, $376. On a comma two-door sedan, it's $434. And on a comma two-door wagon, it's $419. But that's just the beginning. Now let's compare these same deluxe trimmed Comet models against F-85 and special standard models and see the suggested retail price advantage you still get with Comet in each case. On four-door sedans, $244. On four-door wagons, $241. On a comma two-door sedan, it's $299. And on the comma two-door wagon, $284. Now that's certainly something to think about, isn't it? And here's something else. No matter what F-85 or special series or model you buy in 1961, you get your choice of just one power plant, the V8 engine whose basic design they have to share. Here again. Comet gives you real choice. Choose either the improved standard Thrift Power 6 or the all-new Thrift Power 170, optional at extra cost. We'll learn more about these engines later. The important thing here is the actual choice you get with Comet in both models and components. Now, 
functional design. That's how a car should be designed for the people who buy it. Both the F-85 and the Special are smaller than Comet. And note that they have the same basic body. Here, for instance, are comparative outside dimensions. Comet's wheelbase is two inches longer. That's important to the ride. Comet is about six and a half inches longer overall. That's important to styling. And when you think of how many times you and your passengers get in and out of your car in a year, you can see why door size is important too. Well, Comet four-door sedans give you two more inches in door height on both front and rear doors over the F-85 and Special. And you get seven and three quarters inches advantage in rear door width on Comet. Inside, here's another good place to double check figures. For instance, both Buick and Olds claim more front seat headroom. How much? Two tenths of an inch. But how do they manage it? Like this. By simply ignoring the fact that in both cars the front seat height is more than half an inch lower than Comet's. The same kind of arithmetic is used in the rear seat compartment. The apparent one inch additional headroom claimed for either the Special or F-85 only comes about because their rear seat heights are over two inches lower than Comet's. The net result? In Comet, you get full-size car comfort and roominess without sacrificing normal, more comfortable seat heights. Another thing, Comet's extra inches give you more leg and shoulder room in the car, plus three cubic feet more trunk capacity in sedans, and from two to three more cubic feet of cargo space in station wagons. And Comet's better functional design involves some little things too. Like Comet's modern rear-centered gas filler door, compared to the old-fashioned trap door on the left rear fender on both the Special and F-85. And like the extra convenience and carrying capacity of the Comet station wagon's level-loading, counterbalanced tailgate, as against the F-85 and Special's heavy, top-hinged back door. Yes, when it comes to better functional design, Comet certainly gets the nod again. Now what about construction and finish? Well, as we pointed out before, the F-85 and Buick Special share the same basic body. So that means, of course, they must also share the same basic styling. 